I think it's strange that Tyreek Evans was suspended from the league for two years after violating the drug policy. He was not charged with anything criminal. It was simply a violation and it didn't directly affect any other person in any way, unlike the cases that I previously mentioned. Another aspect of the Tyreek Evans case is that it was not a performance enhancing drug. It wasn't like they were trying to protect the sanctity of the game. He received an extremely harsh punishment for doing a recreational drug. I think the NBA just needs to rethink its policy on how it punishes players and coaches.